so we'll be discussing here on the street situations when we're dealing with systems of linear equations into variables and we'll be talking about two equations here so the first equation is 3x plus y equals 5 and as you can see it's actually plotted in the GeoGebra by the way we have a phone application of this and the second equation here is 2x plus y equals 9 as I have mentioned pwede ta magamit og uh, phone application of GeoGebra para mas dali na nato mag graph so dili na dapat manual so if we go further up we can see that these two equations has an intersection now uh, this intersection is actually what we call as our solution now if the situation is like this when two or more lines are intersecting this is what we call as consistent and independent and this means we have exactly one solution and our solution here as you can see no and we call this as our point a ang atong solution ana uh, is negative 4 and 17 okay so x is negative 4 y is 70. now let's go to our second situation so let's plot the first graph and this is uh, 3x minus y equals 4 so na graph na siya no sa ato ang algebra and the second equation is y equals 3x plus 2 so actually bisan og dili na to siya is standard ang iyahang pagka-write sa equation pwede na siya edit sura na graph ni algebra now as you can see here these two lines are not intersecting these two lines are parallel lines no so sa may but pa sa but ani we don't have solution here and this is what we call as inconsistent nga system okay so pag in ani nga inconsistent parallel lines wala tay solution so as you can see dili gid siya mag tabo of course again when we talk about systems of linear uh, equation this is actually for two or more uh, equations but for our particular discussion in this video lesson we're only be focusing on two equations only all right so we are now on our third situation and let's have the first equation this is x plus 3y equals to 6 and nakita na to na graph siya dito no so delete na lisod ang pag graph and let's now go to our second equation and this is actually 2x plus 6y equals to 12. Now, as you can see here, nag-coincide sila. This is, uh, these two lines are coinciding. If that is the case, we call this as consistent and dependent. And this means we have infinitely many solutions, okay? So, dili lang isa ka solution ang atong makita ani, but there are infinitely many. Again, this happens if your two or more equations are coinciding. So, this is it for the three situations when we are solving systems of linear equations.